Hey guys, the Trout91 here. Today we are doing the Riot Shield in the Custom Class Guide. Now the Riot Shield is an incredibly hard equipment to use, so I don't suggest you use it unless you're an experienced player and you don't mind uh, going doing bad. <laughs> it's a two melee kill even against Painkiller usually. Sometimes it gets a third one for unknown reasons. I can't really explain why. It's designed for being a decoy and defense unit. You're not really meant to go out and get kills with it. It's very, very glitchy and broken. I mean, I've been stabbed in over the top of the head, over the top of the shield, into the head. I've been knifed through it. I've been shot through it. I've seen people being shot through it. All that kind of stuff, and it's very, very hard to to get a consistent game with because it's just so glitchy. Uh, the black part, the black part, sorry, actually deflects bullets back at the person that shot them and can hurt them, which is something I didn't know until recently. Uh, it's a free, got three main methods I would suggest trying to kill with, and that's the melee method, the explosives method, and the secondary method, and I'll go over those now for you. The best sidearm I would pick for the melee method is the PP2000, that's something if they're just too out of range and they're not... Uh, they're not an inexperienced player and they're not willing to move, then it's time to get the PP2000 out and go to town on them, if you can. It's better to put the extended mags on because if you're not using stopping power, you can run through the ammo quite quickly and you don't want to have to risk uh, running out of ammo or not having enough ammo in the magazine. And it's always good to use your sec your equipment. I would suggest either putting on throwing knives or C4. You have to be careful though, unless you're using scavenger, you're going to lose them and not have them again once you've used them, unless you pick them up. Uh, the perks I would suggest for the actual meleeing that's bashing them with the right shield is the Marathon Lightweight and Commando. I don't have a problem with using Commando on the right shield just because it's so bad that there's nothing wrong. I don't see a problem with using it. I don't care how overpowered Commando is. You've got to use it on the right shield otherwise you're not going to stand a chance. Even with Commando you can't guarantee you're going to be able to hit them very well. Now the second method is the explosives method and that's the method of using danger close scavenger and RPG so basically what you do is you run around with your right shield and for protection cause a distraction uh, then you can use your stuns or your flash grenades and you can chuck them at someone or if someone's behind a corner or in a room you chuck your C4 that you have as your equipment and you hit you blow them up by double tapping X which is faster than pressing the RB button again and it will explode and you can use your RPGs at long distances uh, the other method is the secondary weapon method. That's basically where you do nothing but use your secondary weapon as as a primary. Uh, for the riot shield, I don't really suggest using the spas 12 unless you use stopping power because it's very very bad now. They've just patched it, so it's a little glitchy and doesn't always get a one shot kill from those ridiculous ranges anymore. It's all about making the perks revolve around your secondary weapon with keeping in mind about the primary weapon which is a riot shield so I would suggest the AA-12 extended mag scavenger lightweight is very good for close quarters maps you're not really going to use this the riot shield on a map like Afghan unless you're really really feeling lucky or fuel or carnival it's just not going to work well maybe not carnival but fuel especially um, that's the riot shield it's very very hard to use I'm not gonna lie it's one you want to mess about with, don't take too seriously. If you take the game a bit seriously, like I sometimes do, I wouldn't suggest using it. Even with my guide, there's no guarantee that it will pay off because this, this right shield just doesn't work half the time. Uh, that's it for today. I will see you for the shotguns. Uh, I'm going to be doing the secondary weapons as well. Uh, they won't be as in-depth, I don't think, because the secondary weapons aren't that hard to use. They're pretty straightforward. Um, I will see you later. Peace out.